Come on, come on. Have you seen the size of this ass? Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Go up, go up. Look at the size of this ass. I could eat that shit off. <laughs> Are you gonna kiss? <laughs> you know where my dog's fast. Guys, I kid you not. I don't know how long. He's my with that. I don't know how long this. What the f do you want? I don't know how long we put this mom on a diet because he just seems to not be losing weight. I think you're genetically just obese. You have a gift, son. Alright, guys, so today we are gonna be looking at something very different, something very weird. We all love Scooby Doo as a kid, enjoy horror, weird, creepy animatronics, children being stuffed in them for some reason. Uh, yeah, today we're watching Scooby Doo. Where are you in Spring Trapped? Okay, I used to watch that as a kid like all the episodes I think there was a really cool one I used to watch it was called like mystery incorporate or something But like it was generally kind of creepy like it wasn't like goofy like it was actually kind of creepy and they were kind of serious about it That one was cool Without further ado, let's war. All right, I'm interested. I wonder if it's gonna have like the scooby-doo kind of cartoon how to explain it um look Oh, hearts in my ears. Oh, it is! It's starting off like a Scooby Doo. Where are you? We got some Scooby Doo. Where are you? We need some help. Oh, look inside that chin, bro. It's like a ball sack. Yo, Daphne's always been bad. Can we just agree? Can we just have appreciation for Daphne, please? Like. That is and Velma, oh my god. <laughs> Fred looks so creepy. What the f <laughs> look there's me in the back, you know, the brown dog. Some kid in my school actually one time was like, Is it is it is it racist if I call you Scooby Doo? Oh Shaggy got is on rollerblades. Now he's taking a shower full of jizz. Oh there's the Oh god so much dog ass in this video. Spring trap. Different. Where are you? Where are you? That's cool, I like that. Oh, this is like an actual Scooby Doo episode. So Scooby Doo, where are you in Springtrap? Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wait, are they actually gonna have voice lines? Oh, is that is that Bonnie or Springtrap? There's a mystery van. Here it is, gang. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. What a groovy spot for a birthday party, Scooby. Thanks. <laughs> like I can already taste the chocolate-covered anchovy pizza. <laughs> That's a good one, Shaggy. That's a good one. Jake, I really like this. This is cool. They're closed. But it was just open when we pulled up. Well, Scoo, like I think we're gonna have to party another day. Okay. Hey, what's that? Like I don't think. Oh, it's security guard. A security guard. Yeah. Why does he look like that? What are you like guys that? doing standing around out here? Well, we came for a birthday party, but the place is closed. That's Bro, why does his chin look like saggy breasts? Someone must have closed shop early. That can't be possible. I'm the only one here. Sounds to me like we have a mystery on our hands. <laughs> Here, you guys can set up camp in my office. You sure run a tight ship around here. Burglars must really like pizza. It's not the burglars I'm after, it's what's already inside. What do you mean, inside? The robots! Here, I'll show you. Jinkies! That's quite the security system. You see, our animatronic band has been acting funny. Uh, during the day, they sing just fine, but at night, he just doesn't want to stay put. I'm sure that bunny has left quite the bunny trail. Oh, so this is like Fred Bear's clues. Diner. This isn't even Already like Freddy's. It, Look at this. It's like the old, old place. Right. So that's Mr. Henry Emily, the owner of the restaurant. I wonder who the other man is. I'm not sure, but whoever he is, it looks like he's wearing a bunny costume. I'm sure Scooby can help us sniff it out. Wait a minute. Where are Shaggy and Scooby? Man, it's a dream come true. Locked in a pizza parlor overnight. Like, this is so much better than a haunted house. Mm -hmm. Let's book the hour. 
Let's find the kitchen, Scooby. Oh, yeah, I remember Shaggy and Scooby are, like, obsessed with food. Like whoever took all the pizza, walk straight through this wall. Like what would a ghost do with all that? Eyes behind you! Ah! <laughs> the way Scooby's running. Oh, Springtrap's running like a uh, Scooby Doo character. I like that. Monday morning. <laughs> that is actually really cool. He just steal her. <laughs> he just knocked her glasses. Well, Scoob, we're as cooked as a pizza pie. <laughs> what? Look, Scoob, I think we got him. Oh, they're gonna unmask him. I gotta hand it to you, kids. I never would have found this secret room without your help. But one question still remains. What's going on with that bunny? Why, don't you recognize him? It's William Afton! Yep, Henry Emily's old business partner. William was jealous of Henry's success, so he created the ghost of Springtrap to scare customers away from Freddy's. But I thought the bunny was a robot. He had us fooled for a while, too. But with his patented spring lock technology, he was able to make the suit appear to be a robot by day. And like a totally spooky ghost by night. <clears throat> nah, if it weren't for those faulty spring locks, I would have gotten away with it too. Good going, gang. Another mystery in the books. <laughs> like if this <laughs> one's a spring lock, what's that one? Oh. Where are you? I honestly thought it was gonna be some really mad, like, demonic twist at the end of that. Like, I don't know, like, maybe the locks would have, like, springed on Scooby's face or something. I know that's really messed up, but it was actually just gonna be a normal Scooby Doo episode. You know what? I actually really wish they done that with Scooby Doo. Like, they done, like, crossovers. I don't know, did they? I can't really remember, like, when I was watching it as a kid. I think Scooby Doo would have been really cool with crossovers. I don't know, that was really weird. Like, I was expecting some really weird, like, demonic twist. I don't really know. Anyways, guys, if you guys did enjoy this video, you know to drop a like and turn the notification bell. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. Take care of yourself.